Chris Wyndham, Human Nature Magazine, here with Dave Metzer, the chairman of the Unstoppable Foundation, celebrating its 10th anniversary here today in Los Angeles. Now, how does it feel to have a wordy cause go for 10 years? It's not easy. And, and, and how does it make you feel just to see, you know, the gala and everything come together? You know, I always say if it's easy, everybody would do it. <laughs> and so I really look and enjoy the process and the growth that we've experienced. And I really look forward to the next 10 years. And okay. uh, this signifies kind of an expansion. This is our last gala, taking it from kind of a regional, even local feel of uh -huh. gala, which sells out every year, to an international uh, scaling so that we can truly impact not only the 75,000 people that we've already impacted, right. but millions in ground. And, and of all the people you help, like what type of stories jump out the most? I know it's a lot of the them. The one that, that steps out the most is when I went to Kenya, visited uh -huh. the first woman high school. Most women don't make it to high school. Right. And I have three high school uh, daughters. Okay. Three awesome. Three teenage daughters. And they're all hardworking. I grew up in a family that believes in education. But I went over there and when I was a kid, and as a sports agent, I ran Jerry, you know, Lee Steinberg, and yeah, I was a yeah. sports agent. Uh, I saw kids that you had to peel off the field. You know, when the light came on, you had to beg them to come in. Well, in the Masamari, at this high school, you had to beg these girls to wow. get out of the classroom. Okay. They wanted to stay until 11 o'clock at night. They wanted to wake up at 5 in the morning. They exhausted their teachers. So that commitment and passion really inspired me to really figure out right. how can I carry this over to change the world. And you have, you have a sports background. And so how did you make the, the transition to you know helping out with an organization like the Unstoppable Foundation? Well, Cynthia reached out to me to be on her board of advisors uh -huh. to help get athletes and celebrities to come to the gala. The very next year, she asked me to come on the board. Uh -huh. And then last year, I came on as the chairman of the board. Wow. So it was an evolution, an inspiring relationship. Cynthia Kersey wooed me, and has, uh, ever since, I've been her biggest fan. Wow. Well, congratulations on the 10th anniversary. Good luck with all the future endeavors in the organization. Chris Wyndham, Human Nature Magazine.